All right, John Newley right there. Up next, we have the keys to the game now. We go to Alyssa Charleston. Thanks, Tom. Well, it's always an exciting week when both the men's and the women's teams are playing the Montana schools. And there aren't many matchups that are more storied or exciting as the one that the Vandals have with the Montana Grizz. Two programs with a tradition of success and high standards, but they will only meet once in Big Sky regular season play. The Vandal men will have their hands full with Montana's impressive post play in Martin Brunick, who's posted four double-doubles in the last six games. Montana also has good outside scoring from Walter Wright and Brandon Gefeller, but a lot of Montana's points come from turnovers, as they have the best scoring defense in the conference. So Idaho will definitely need to take care of the ball. As for Montana State, they've had a few tough, close losses that have put them at two and four in regular season play. They're led in scoring by freshman guard Tyler Hall with almost 18 points a game. Idaho will have to take advantage of the Bobcats' poor shooting percentage because as of late, they're just 41%, eighth best in the big sky. The Vanda women will really have to utilize the confidence they gained on their last road sweep if they want to beat the Grizz. Montana has two impressive scorers in Kaylee Valley and McCauley Feller, averaging 20 and 18 apiece in conference. Idaho has historically contained Valley really well, forcing her to take tough shots, and they'll need to continue that and take advantage of the fact that they're playing the Grizz right here at home. If the Vandals can get past Montana, their reward is an undefeated Montana State team. Jasmine Hamas fuels the Bobcats offense with 15 a game. Fans may recognize a well-known face on MSU's bench this year as former NBA point guard John Stockton joined the coaching staff this year for his daughter Lindsey Stockton's senior season. And again, this is the only time in the regular season that the Vandals will face off against the Montana schools, so expect some competitive play. Those are your keys to this week's games. Tom? Hey, thanks Alyssa right there for the keys to the game and that'll wrap it up for this week's edition of Inside the Vandals. Make sure to join us next week as we look back at the games against Montana and Montana State. Until then, we will see you next time and as always, make sure to like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. See you next week.